Welcome to Camper Jam. I think we've been a little bit optimistic with the weather, but we're going to try and make a go of it. Circus. Yeah. Look at that. Well done. I'm going to go to the circus. Well done, mate. You ready? I think you've just got to go for it, Tom. Come for me. Go. Go. What are you doing? Are you just spinning plates? Not a worry in the world. That's easy. This is just easy. Good morning from a better looking day. Hopefully we actually get some footage today. It's Sunday. Yesterday was absolutely torrential, as you've probably seen. Just didn't really get out. So today we're gonna to walk down now, show you the shops, show you the vans, and show you what Camper Jam is all about. To give you a rough idea, this is an overspill car park. Not very good at guesstimating things, but there's gotta be over a thousand vans there. And then as we cross into this gate, we're in more of the actual arena parking. There's just thousands and thousands of vans. I'm sure there's 20,000 people here, from what I can gather. Could be way off that guesstimate. Massive event. So cool. So as you're probably picking up, it's obviously a festival vibe cool flags everywhere we bought our first flagpole yesterday but we need to buy a proper flag music's been bang on we got drenched and rained off last night at about what time did we give in half ten yeah uh no it was about just before ten just before ten yeah. that was rubbish we saw kylie minogue or rogue minogue who was decent dancing away to that and then it started raining again and we'd already been soaked in an absolutely torrential downpour which was rubbish really really shivery to the bone he thought now this, this is not enjoyable anymore let's go and get warm <laughs> so we got some churros and went back to the van but today we're going to try and make the most of it because the sun's out the sky looks fairly clear i just want to see some vans and make the most of it because i feel like we were just sat under a gazebo and in the van yesterday and some of our friends have got a dog they've entered it into a dog show hopefully see the show in shine as well so we'll show you that but uh, we're we'll walking down into the main concourse area now with all the shops and all the cool bits. So we'll show you that. I'll tell you what I won't miss. That little smell emanating from over there. Every time you walk through that. You know, like when you get off a plane on holiday and the heat hits you. It's like that, but <clears throat> very different. Love shows like this. Absolutely love them. But they don't help you when you're trying to decide on getting things for the van because all you can see is new wheels new styles new kits people waving Yo. yes what color? nice bay leaf green L love our bay leaf green magic teapot though where you've got tea coffee and music and i believe it's donation only and i thought it's pretty smart that because if you had a price people pay you that price but if you ask for a donation i think people tend to give you a little bit more than what the price would be
having a chat to the gear knob maker, Art Cole, and he said it's going to rain again at dinner time, but the quality and the feel of those gear knobs is unbelievable. Really nice and only between 40 and 50 pounds. Would have definitely had one, but he can't make them for the auto gearbox. Hopefully, yet, because if he does, I'd have one of them. Make it those flavours what you will, blue, orange and red. I'm going to go with bubblegum, orange and strawberry. I got Vimto, strawberry and blueberry. No, not blueberry. I forgot what I got. bubblegum? No, I didn't get bubblegum. I got Vimto, strawberry and I think raspberry or something. I uh, know, um, but it's nice. But I didn't realise that it would come out that quick. So. <laughs> Is that why you're a bit red heavy? Yeah. into class seven there's more vans to look at which is all the volkswagen vehicles inevitably i'm going to see a mark one golf and i will want to get another one <laughs> As with most shows like this, there's some absolutely stunning vans and vehicles knocking about on the showground, rightly so. But it's like when you go to car shows and the car parks are full of cars that are stunning. It's like everyone camping here has got awesome vans. So it's this is one event I definitely get. And if you've never been to it, get it in your calendar for next year. So it's a proper family show. Loads of rides, the food's fantastic, the vans, the people, everything is exemplary. As you can see, it's a very different night to last night. It was absolutely sopping wet. But today, Sunday, final day, sun's come out. But we're going to head to the fur now. There is a huge arena there. Through. There is the main stage. It is, it is a proper festival. It's set up like a proper festival. Just walking past the dog show, but there's nothing on at the minute. And there's loads of food to pick from. I've had some really good food. I had some chicken tikka wraps and a duck wrap. Kids have had cheeseburgers, we've had pizzas. It's expensive, but it's going to be because you're paying for that premium. Chaos! 
someone's gonna get it now. Come on, Logan. Let's get him. Logan, no! <laughs> Bordering on dangerous. I haven't even got my belt on. What do you think of that? Good. Yes. Dodgem's done and dusted. Back, bottom, vertebra, done and dusted. But uh, great fun. Love the Dodgems. It's great getting out and seeing, getting on kids' rides that you've not been on for probably, well, I haven't been on the Dodgems for years. Just turns you into a kid again. Love it. It's time for dinner, and Ethan has picked pies and sides. So I've got a jacket potato with cheese and beans. Me and Logan are sharing. It's nice, isn't it? Me and EJ got a nice looking steak and ale pie with chips. Steak and ale pies were 12 pounds each. Um, how much was your jacket called, babe? Eight pounds, that's with two fillings. Yeah. All right. Dougie wants to do the festival. It's the puppy show. Thank you for watching our Camper Jam 2023 vlog. We are Adventures with the Nicklins. Like and subscribe. Next up, we got packing for our Florida trip, which is happening in a couple of weeks. Two weeks on Tuesday. Woohoo! Ooh. Yes. But for now, bye bye from Camper Jam. Bye. bye. Hi, um, my mates wanted me to do a shout out, so yeah, shout out to my mates. <laughs>